Hi guys, we're here from Aqua Smith, and in today's video, if you guys are interested in starting on Blue Water, we have a affordable way and affordable setup that we have here. And like I said, if you guys are interested and thinking that it's expensive, it is. You're gonna need, of course, your main buoys, which will cost you about 300, uh, about 300 bucks, and you need two floats. Same with your bungee line that rigs onto your buoy, which will also cost about 200 bucks and if you're planning on getting your ready-made flashers those things too can cost up to 200 bucks so the setup you see here is a affordable way that we used and this is our blue water setup all right so i'll start off you can see our main buoy we got a dive flag and this buoy is actually a boat fender so you guys can find it it's not too expensive compared to your actual buoy and this is going to be our main buoy connected to our float line you can see here and we do sell this here at our shop we have this ice line here and the line winder itself and we have this rigged onto your onto your gun so if you have a for example 120 or a longer gun that, that's a perfect length to also start with blue water so yeah, you can see we have our float line connected onto our spear gun right here. And you can do this, and there's also another way, which is a breakaway system where your line is connected to the shooting line, and when you take your shot, the fish will pull onto the line and you don't have to fight it, it will fight directly to the buoy, but we have this setup right here. So yeah, you can get your buoys, and of course you're gonna need a second buoy, and this is the second buoy right here. If you guys are doing beach cleanups, you can usually find these around or maybe have some laying around the house or maybe somebody does, you can just find this and get it. This is perfect for your second buoy. You can clip this onto your main buoy just in case uh, you shoot something really big and it does take this down. At least you have a spare buoy to support your main buoy. Also, Important things are tuna clips, you're going to need tuna clips, also carabiner clips and we have carabiner clips installed onto our flashers um, you can see it's just mono line with uh, flasher plates, we have this here at our shop also the reflective tape itself and this is our main flasher here which is actually a lure also like I mentioned the carabiner clip you can uh, clip this onto your buoy so when you're still doing a reef dive because what we do is we do reef dive shoot our chum and we have this uh, put away onto our buoy so it's not uh, getting in the way it's not bothering us we're still shooting reef fish and if you want to switch to blue water you can swim out and then this thing's ready you can set it up uh, let it hang wait a couple minutes maybe about an hour and if nothing shows back you can start chumming so yeah this is pretty affordable to make compared to buying a ready-made one and also we have a throw flasher now I made a video on this we'll leave a link on the description this is really cheap and uh, easy to make so yeah this is the throw flasher itself and a rubber rubber band all, all rubber band to keep it from floating uh, sinking too quick so yeah if you guys are interested in starting blue water we can have the same setup which is way cheaper compared to buying them uh, uh, ready-made which is which will cost about uh, 1000 bucks and this setup will help you save about 800 dollars all right guys that's all i got for today thank you for watching